Good evening, everybody. This is Steve Fletcher with The Trumpet for My People. Today is December 21st, 2022. And I wanted to share this piece of information with you guys. Um, If we are looking at the calendar based on uh, the Torah calendar and the true beginning of Hanukkah on December 19th, going through December 27th, then what we're going to have is the fourth day of Hanukkah is going to be December 22nd going into December 23rd. Okay, so true true midweek Hanukkah is going to be uh, tomorrow, December 22nd through December 23rd. Um, and um, today there was a very important sign that Israel's government was formed and announced Today, they're not going to be having a Knesset meeting yet until next week, but the government has been formed and uh, Benjamin Netanyahu has announced the uh, formation of the coalition government. He did that before the uh, December 21st midnight deadline. And um, so now we're going into uh, midweek Hanukkah, okay, December 22nd. I want to share this piece of information with you guys. Um, Someone brought to my attention recently that there is a planetoid in the solar system that is named Fletcher. There's a planetoid uh, in the solar system that is named Fletcher. Okay, so I want to share um, this because it's pretty much in conjunction with what we are seeing As we're watching the uh, winter solstice and the sun coming through the golden gate between Ophiuchus and uh, Sagittarius, uh, Fletcher planetoid is in that alignment uh, right now as we're watching um, Hanukkah leading up to midweek Hanukkah. And um, whether it's midweek Hanukkah or the end of Hanukkah, we are here. Uh, in a very important watch time, and um, God has given me a specific calling and uh, purpose for this time, and uh, I find it interesting that even in the heavens there's a planetoid with my name on it. (laughs) Very interesting. Okay, so this is uh, tomorrow uh, going on midnight, uh, December 22nd. Um, In the normal Stellarium program, uh, the Fletcher planetoid does not show up. You have to find it in a um, Stellarium mobile app. It comes up in the Stellarium mobile app. Okay, and and so this is what we're looking at above on the uh, normal Stellarium program. We have uh, the sun and the moon. Basically, they're coming into conjunction. Uh, the moon is just going to be going past the sun, and um, over the next day or two is going to be the beginning of the new month, okay, as the moon goes past the sun. They're in the golden gate there in between uh, Ophiuchus and Sagittarius, and Ophiuchus is the one that represents Michael, uh, who's throwing out the serpent, Okay, and so this is a very interesting uh, sign in the heavens that connects the uh, sun with with the uh, with Ophiuchus. Only this time of year in December, basically, uh, you know, from from uh, the beginning of December through around December eighteenth, a lot of uh, constellation charts don't even show Ophiuchus as a principal or as a main um, constellation. It goes from Scorpius to Sagittarius, and Ophiuchus does not count. But a lot of other uh, sources show Ophiuchus as the 13th constellation. Okay, so well, in between this, uh, in these two constellations, we have what is known as the Milky Way galaxy or the Golden Gate, uh, the, the, heaven, the heavenly Golden Gate. And so this is where the moon and the sun are. Um, and then we have, of course, we have the other planets, that are also in alignment at this time. Venus, Mercury, um, Saturn, and Jupiter are also in this alignment. And so 
if you look down um, on the screenshots below, this comes up in the Stellarium mobile app, okay? So what we have then is we have this alignment of Jupiter, Saturn, Venus, Mercury, the Sun, uh, the Moon, and then the Fletcher planetoid is right there in this alignment. And, um, you know, I have no idea why this is there or what, uh, what this could mean. All I'm just sharing with you is that I do know that God has given me a purpose and given me a calling to share, especially all the signs that I've seen over the years leading to Hanukkah, where we are right now. And uh, I find it very interesting that exactly on midweek Hanukkah, as the moon is coming into conjunction with the sun, the location of that uh, at this time of year, and then right there is the Fletcher planetoid uh, in this specific uh, lineup. Okay, and so I just wanted to share this with you. I don't know if that means anything special or not, but um, we are watching a lot of signs here in in between Hanukkah, midweek Hanukkah. We could be going all the way to the end of Hanukkah, but we're hoping to be out of here tomorrow, hopefully tomorrow. <laughs> hopefully tomorrow. Hopefully we don't have to wait until the end of the week. Hopefully we don't have to wait and go through another Oh, Christmas and see what happens. Okay. I know. Now, this is another sign that could be pointing to midweek Hanukkah. And I just want to share this with you. I saw this on Mark Allison's uh, channel and uh, it was quite interesting. I had never noticed this before because I've seen this uh, Weird Al Yankovic sh uh, a song many times before Christmas at Ground Zero. But I never picked this up that uh, at the end of the song here, uh, this is right at the end here. If you go to the 251 marker, you're going to see that uh, Al Yankovic in, mid, in the middle of a, a bunch of kids is making a, uh, a nine-prong menorah, okay? And so he's talking about Christmas at ground zero, and he's in the middle, okay? He's the middle candle, which is the place of Jesus, okay? The, the Jesus is the shamash. He's the middle candle of Hanukkah, okay? And uh, so they're talking about Christmas at ground zero, but there's an obvious connection to not only Christmas, but Hanukkah. Okay. And so, I mean, if they're looking at Christmas at ground zero, then maybe something is going to happen just before Christmas and we're not going to be here for Christmas. Okay. And this could be another sign pointing to midweek Hanukkah, just as, uh, this song here shows Al Yankovic in the middle of the eight children forming a menorah. And so here we have a Christmas Hanukkah connection when it talks about Christmas at ground zero. So this is what I wanted to share with you guys. Um, I just thought it was an interesting detail. Someone did bring it to my attention and I thought it was uh, worth sharing with you guys. I do pray you guys are blessed. Have a good night. This is Steve Fletcher with the Trumpet for My People, the sign of his coming revealed.